If you are using soft chalk content in your course, there is a known bug that uh, it will come in very, very strange. So I'm going to go through the process of what you have to do in order to get the soft chalk files to work correctly. The first thing you need to do is make sure you have the original soft chalk files and you have them packaged in, in a zip format. Once you have that, once you come into your course, I'm in my particular play course here, you go to edit course, you'll go down to manage files. <clears throat> and what you're going to want to do is, for me, I would go ahead and create a folder. So I'm going to click on new folder. I'm going to give the folder a name. In this case, this happens to be the staining lesson. And I'll go ahead and save that. I'm going to open up that folder. And while I have that folder open, I'm going to go ahead and upload the document. I'm going to go to Upload. I'm going to find the zip file. I'm going to double-click on it, and it's going to upload. I then go ahead and click Save. Once it's uploaded, the next step I have to do is click on the little action menu arrow right there and go to unzip. And that's going to go ahead and unzip it inside of the manage file area within uh, Desire to Learn. And it's in this folder here. Once I do that, the next step is to go to the content. So you'll see I'm in manage files. I can go to content. And I'm going to go ahead into the module I want to place this in. In this case, I'm going to place it in Module 1. I'm going to go ahead and click a new. I'm going to click Create a File. I'm going to give this a name. And then what I'm going to do in here is I could put any text I want in here if I want for them to understand what they have to do. But in order to get this to link to the soft chalk file, what I need to do is click on this little icon here, which is called a quick link. I'm going to choose course files because I've already uploaded the files here and I'm going to go ahead and choose the staining lesson here. I'm going to choose the folder that has the index.html file. That's the file that I want, index.html. Now one of the things I want to do is instead of me just clicking on it, there's a little, I don't know what you call it, a little icon over here that looks like a little pencil. It's called options. It's real important to click on that. So I click on that that's going to bring up what's called the HTML properties. I'm going to go ahead and highlight this and give it a name. This is what it's going to be linked to. And this is the most important step in the process. Please click New Window. Please click New Window. I'm going to go ahead and click Insert. I'm going to go ahead and click Publish. And you'll see when a student comes into this, and it's an extra click, but that's just the way it is. They click on that. It opens in a new tab, as you can see. It'll have everything in it that you've done in Soft Chalk. Any icons, any things, the students, when they're done, can go ahead and close that if they want. So that's how you get your Soft Chalk lesson into your Desire to Learn course.